Hey guys, welcome back to Top 5 Friday, and this time around we're doing video game conspiracies. Have you ever felt that something weird or shady was going on in a game, that the developers were purposely trying to mislead you or hide some weird, horrifying secret in their games? Well, here's a whole list of theories you can get paranoid over. Five. Now most of my Final Fantasy theories revolve around why the franchise has gotten so terrible lately. I'm still trying to prove that at some point during Final Fantasy XIII, the writers all started huffing spray paint during their writers meetings. But anyway, this theory isn't about that, it's about a suspicious fan who says that Squall, the main character of Final Fantasy VIII, is actually dead for a large part of the game. The idea is that the giant ice shard that result of being near death. It would explain some of the weird trippy imagery that appears in the game that I'd formerly blamed on the writers drug habits. Four. This next one's a little weird, but apparently killed him already. And if you translate this number code into Morse code, you get creepy messages like, Hey, did you watch my new YouTube video? And the queen has died today. The world mourns. And there are also dates that go the creepiness for yourself. However, since no one was actually able to capture these messages or replicate them, you should know going in that there's not a lot of evidence to back this one up. Three. Raise your hand if you played Animal Creature giving you a ride, right? WRONG! He's based on the Japanese Kappa, a river imp known for kidnapping kids. Look at the similarities between Kappin and this ancient illustration of a Kappa. BAM! Someone called Animal Crossing are always shut. So enjoy your child abduction cult simulator, you weirdos. I hope you find some nice decorations for your eternal prison. Two. So if you're a Mass Effect fan, you probably know that prolonged exposure to Reapers causes indoc- Reaper-induced hallucination? It's a fan theory that's fairly popular, maybe because so many people hated the ending of Mass Effect 3. None. One. Alright, there's a lot of bizarre Pokemon theories out there. Stuff you've probably heard already, like Gary's Raticate died during a fight, or Cubone and Marowak are the same species. But if there's one theory that I firmly believe to be correct, it's that Professor Oak is trying to bang Ash's mom. Think about it, why else would he send you, a child, to catch every Pokemon in the freaking world? Yeah, that's right, he spent his entire life studying Pokemon, but then all he's got to hand you with his research is a blank Pokedex, and he says, fill her up. That's BS. Ash is dead. He doesn't even really care if you live or die. He's sending you after monsters capable of breathing fire and shooting f***ing electricity. Face it, Ash, while you were out playing with your Pokeballs, your mom was playing with Oaks Balls. Alright guys, there's five video game conspiracy theories that keep me up at night. What about you? 